Hello, welcome back guys. In this session, we are going to control DC motors with Arduino Nano. We can't control a DC motor directly with Arduino. So we are using a module called L293D. Using L293D motor driver, we can control the speeds and the direction of the motor. So let's get started. First of all, we are building our code with mblock5. mblock5 is a graphical programming software. We already know that. So here uh, you need to add your Arduino Nano code. You can search for it and you can add. Okay. Uh, and the next we are going to events and drag and drop when Arduino starts up go to controls drag and drop forever and go to pins we are using PWM pins for controlling the speed of the motor and we need two digital pin go to control the speed of the motors we are setting the PWM pin for uh, one in nine the speed should be in under 255 we are, uh, we are giving the maximum value to 55 and the second thing we are in this digital pin you you should give the uh, motor pins the motor pins to 10 and 11 10 and 11 I think now about the uh, basics of Arduino sorry uh, basics of uh, DC motor uh, you can see the DC motor have two pins if you want to uh, run the DC motor in, uh, in clockwise direction you should give one pin high and one pin low right uh, if you want to uh, run the DC motor in, uh, in reverse direction or, or anti clockwise direction you should give the uh, upper pin to low and this pin to high you can give either direction uh, that's your choice connect your Arduino board and you should make our circuit you can download the circuit in the description below so uh, let's make the uh, circuit here is the circuit I builder this is the Arduino Nano board and I'm connecting the pins this is the pin I connected in, uh, in the code this one is 9, 10 and 11 you can see them and this is the motor driver L293 and here I am giving the pin uh, orange color to I4 I3 and E2. E2 is a pin that is used for controlling the speed of DC motor. That's why we set the value to 5 uh, in the PWM pin 9. You can see that the green wire is going to the 9th pin. The 9th pin is the Arduino PWM pin to control the speed of DC motor. So uh, just upload this code, connect, and here is the motor connection M1, M1, M2. I'm connecting the first motor in M1 and M2. Okay, then. Uh, I given the power supply here. Okay. 
here I'm using the lithium battery to give the power supply uh, I'll show you the voltage that I provided here okay, almost 7.71 volt that's enough to control the DC motor so first we are controlling one DC motor and next step we will control the second one so let's upload this code just click upload okay right now this motor is running let's uh, enable the, the other one the other DC motor duplicate this pins and give five six seven upload this code right now this new DC motor is run you can see there Just control the speed of uh, the first DC motor. Looking at this one, Let's see if speed is changing. I'm giving it to 100. Load the code. You can see that the motor speed almost changed. Five. Seems seven. Seems to fifty. You can see that we can't uh, DC motor speed uh, is, uh, fifty because uh, this DC motor can't. Uh, work with this speed so we need to give uh, minimum speed I think maybe. Yes. Uh, give the minimum value to 90 okay uh, or depends on your motor you got uh, will work with different speeds it, maybe you can you can uh, control the motor with 50 or 30 uh, it depends on your DC motor specification so uh, that's all about today uh, in this session, uh, we learned about the uh, L293 motor driver. In the next session, we are making a robot, three-wheeled robot using L293 motor driver. So wait for that and see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys.